In today's mathematical exercise, I am solving conditional tasks from the greatest strategy game, StarCraft. <laughs> this is the fun. Here is the condition. Five hydralisks are attacking a Terran command center. center. Hydralisks should make 11 damage each and the command center has 105,000 hit points. How many times each Hydralisk have to shoot to destroy the command center? Now the Hydralisks are units of the Zerg and this is a Terran command center. Let me see how many times the Hydralisk should shoot to destroy it. And what should be the math here? First, I will find the overall damage of the Hydralisks. That should be 11 multiplied by 5. This is 55. So 55 is the damage of the 5 Hydralisks. Now what I have to do is to divide the hit points by the damage. That should be 105,000 divided by 55 mm -hmm. by 55 that should be 27 point 27 27 27 now if everyone all hydralisks shoot 27 times the command the command center will have 0 0.27 hit points so so they have to shoot one more. That should be 28. Should be the answer. <laughs> so the next conditional tasks task. That is seven dragoons, that is a Protoss unit, are attacking a Zerg hive. Dragoon shots make 21 damage per second and the hive has 205,000 hit points. How many seconds the hive for how many seconds the hive will fall? Like before, first I have to find how many damage, how much damage the dragoons make for one second. That should be 21 multiplied by 7. That equals 147. <coughs> is the damage for second. Now I have to divide through 2500 by 147. Again. That will equal 17 seconds. <laughs> the wounds are stronger. I will not round it here, so it should be a plain 17. Right. I believe the professional StarCraft players know at least the small numbers. For example, how many adepts can destroy one marine for how many shots or something like that in the early game. Maybe this is important when they are macroing. Okay, third, the third conditional tasks, task is three siege tanks are attacking a Protoss Nexus. Siege tanks shots make 32 damage per two seconds and the Protoss shields regenerate with two points per second. For how many seconds the Nexus will fall? Now this is a little complicated because we have to add the regenerating hit points, right? But let's begin as usual. First, we have to find the overall damage of the siege tanks. That should be 3 multiplied by 32. That equals 696, right? Divided by 2, because this is for 2 seconds, I want to find it for 1 second. That should equal 40, 
48. So, 48 is the damage of three siege tanks for one second. Now this is the Nexus hit points and shield. They both equal to 105,000. So, to find the seconds without the regeneration, I will first find the shields that is divided by 48. That means 31.22. I will round it. Sale it, I think, and it should be plain 32 seconds. So it will take 32 seconds if there is no shield regeneration. But now for 32 seconds, I will multiply this by 2 to find how many points the shield will regenerate. That equals 64, that is 64 additional hit points. And the tanks should shoot two more times to take this 64 hit points. So 32 plus 2 is equal to 34. Now the answer here should be 34. But uh, because the browser cache used the older version where it is not fixed, now <laughs> that uh, application, there was an error which used the field from the previous task where it was 17, but from now on it should be 34. So, to get my knowledge level I should type 17, but it's not correct, it's 34. And this should be for today. Tomorrow I will make similar exercise, but with units from StarCraft 2 game. If you are curious, well, until new meetings then.